William Heimdall, or Prince William as his master has nicknamed him, swapped comic books for the old masters in his mid-teens. Chiefly inspired by Odd Nörden's work, and having studied for a period with his son Öde, Heimdall's work has already reached an impressive quality. This is your space. Yes. Great. It's a new one. Yeah, well, it's just a sketch. I see that. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> How big is it going to be? Well, I, I don't know if I will make it any larger. Uh -huh. We'll see. But, uh, do you see who it is? Yes, it's um, me and names. It's Saint Michael. Yes, of course. There's a great uh, Saint Michael in uh, Vienna. Okay. Uh, by Giordano. Yeah, that's a great story. He, um, uh, Giordano was praised because he was able to emulate the, the styles of, uh, of um, other painters. Okay. That was, uh, he was much admired f uh, for his ability to do so. Huh. And the dragon there, how did you... Like what? What are you? What are you basing yourself on? Uh, it's imagination. You know, you read what Leonardo writes about dragons. No. He does. He, he, he check out this notebook. Okay. I don't remember the exact phrasing, but it's something about copy paste different animals uh, together, and you, you get a dragon. Okay. Yeah, he has this uh, clear recipe. Huh. Uh. Okay, but the other stuff that you're working on here. Like what's going on here? Oh, well, I can see what's going on here. Yeah, it's the uh, baptism of Christ. Baptism, yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know, I was living a little bit in, in Iceland uh, well, quite a few years ago. I was working on a, a painting I did uh, uh, called Three Philosophers. And I was working on that sketch. Mm -hmm. And you had two people there and one, one person there. And I think it was uh, Nerd Remir commented that they were too far up apart, mm -hmm. uh, or uh, I made the change anyways. And he said something about, uh, it was talking about how the, the family structure today is so distanced that you sort of st <laughs> it's in your mind and it comes out through your hand that you replace figures apart. Yeah. That's a weird, weird <laughs> thing, you know, if that's true. I mean, it's, it's, it's an intriguing thought at least, you know, that, oh, yes. uh, that it manifests itself, uh, these unconscious biases. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, yeah, it was just uh, okay, but I understand that. If, so you're go, going to move in here. Yep. This will be. Yep. Right. And I mean, the proportions are off. Uh, he looks way too big, and so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but the gray tones here, it's uh, is are really nice. Thank you. Uh, but I've seen that you've got much more. Uh, clear in the line, much more tight in some way. Yes. It's like, uh, why, why did that happen? Well, 
because this is this is phenomenal. This is really oh, clear, you. you know. But it's that you can manage to have it so clear without being popping out or being sort of on top of the canvas, but but still integrated yeah. in the room. Yeah, well, uh, it is it is actually uh, partly your fault because of this uh, <laughs> uh, the hunt of Nerdrum, where you see that uh, oh, yeah. he first tried to to reach up to Caravaggio and then he moves up and up and up. Yeah, yeah. You know, so. Mm. So I've uh, put myself an aim that uh, by the age of 35, I should be as good as Caravaggio. That's yeah. the Which aim gives you how many years now? Uh, 17? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, okay, well that's like two decades. Yeah. Uh, that's feasible. <laughs> yeah. An original member of the Memorosa group, Heimdall follows strict dogma that forbids him from using photos as well as blue and green pigments. He works from live model and aims at crafting stories instead of pictures. To see it for myself, I attend an hour-long session with Heimdall to witness the benefits of a constrained approach. Is this how you would normally start? Well, what uh, the wet in wet technique is sort of uh, the person coming out from mist, mm. but uh, uh, the way I work is uh, very opposite. It's mm -hmm. the person going into the mist. So as this proceeds um, in a couple of days, uh, well, first it's going to be very clear and uh, very bombastic. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's going to be sanded down and uh, it will be it will go more uh, into the fog okay so you start with sort of strong lights not necessarily not necessarily strong colors but strong lights clear forms and then sort of yeah, sand it down or, or start working with it yes mm -hmm. Thank you for watching this preview from the School of Appellus. To watch the full video and access our premium library, go to caveofappellus.com slash donate and become a $10 patron. That's caveofappellus.com slash donate.